Here we have. Here we have a, a working bubble gun. All right, bubbles. Great. Bubbles. This one start working. And what happened was this bit on here when it if it focuses, yes. See there that little bit where it's in the bottom bit. What had happened? This part. When I get my finger right on the bit, oops. That bit there is like a little knobbly bit, and it was in the circle and it wasn't working properly similar to that one there similar to this one similar to that one but what happened is the uh, the rings around the edge the rings around there had actually broken like so it did quite a thing so I had a brainwave putting something in there to keep it back but then I had to keep that back so I've used that obviously it's cracked that a little bit but hey ho it's only a cheap little thing anyway so that to keep that in place which then keeps that in place which, when you put it back together, it should, in theory, start to uh, blowing bubbles again. Okay, so here is the test. It uh, when I put it on, did a little crack on. Which you probably can't see, but you know where, where that little thing was. It caught on it, so it's a little tiny crack there. But hey, well, let's give it a go. See if it works. Now, oh. <laughs> epic fail. That's broke. Uh. <laughs> I think that's what they call um that it's not working. Oh well, worth a try. Part two. What I realised, I think I've done something on that thing there, you see. I've, I managed to get something to stay in. But when I put a top on, what was happening was the nail was going straight into the bit underneath. Sort of little the little cog that turned on there. So what I've had to do is bend that round to see if I can get it at a certain way. And then but oh, hey, let's have a try. Hey! DIY Dave does it again. Now I don't know how long it's going to last for, but let's enjoy the bubbles while we can. Squirt the wife. So she can join in the, the joy and the the cheeriness, the fact that I've fixed it. Yeah. Mother and son both enjoying playing with the bull guns, especially because I've fixed one, so we can squirt one as well. How good that? I'm so impressed with myself. I was determined to fix it, even though it only cost well, about one pound fifty something off like that. But it was a principle of the thing, and we're not because we're not at it long. I thought, well, why should we not enjoy it? Keep squirting, there, Lucas. Keep squirting, Mum. Oh well, yeah, a little bit. Too. Hi everyone, right. For people that know me know that the only bits of DIY that I tend to do is ones where I can keep my feet on the ground, not on ladders, because I hate ladders, right? Can't be doing with ladders. Um, steps are all right to a certain extent, but I, again, I, sometimes if they're a bit wobbly or whatever, I don't feel safe on them, as you probably appreciate, and a lot of people probably feel the same as well. Um, so, in this next bonus clip, um, is something that I'm quite proud of myself, actually. You know, it's, okay, he's not 20 trading standards by any means, you know what I mean? But it was something that, um, well, you'll see in the video why I'm quite pleased. And I'd like to thank you as well for watching this video of me repairing the water gun. And if you'd like, uh, give a thumbs up or a like or whatever they call it now on YouTube and uh, subscribe to the channel if you'd like to. And if there's anything you'd like to see, give me a let me know and I'll uh, keep the videos coming. Thank you very much. Take care. Here's my attempt at repairing the roof bit because uh, I went into the shed this morning and you could see daylight through the middle of the top so what I thought was I'd ch chuck a big piece over the top okay there's a bit of a roll out there but who cares uh, and I used some of the old tacks from before stuck it on the top and I don't think I've done too bad a job to say it's my first attempt and first there climbed on there and then so I walked well done that bit and then walked stood on that bit and walked all the way along did all that lot and then come back down here jobs are good